<laughs> Hi, everyone. So we are here with Sherry Wachter, as we always are every Saturday, bringing you who we have today with the Broward Humane Society. So let's talk about Polo. Okay, so this is Handsome Polo, who sits for a treat incredibly. Now, he is wearing a jersey with his name on it, and that is to promote an event we have going on today. It's called Underdog Madness. Um, we are featuring about 10 dogs that have been overlooked at the shelter, sadly. I don't know why. They are great dogs. Polo is five years old. He loves kids. Um, he's good with other dogs, but he just needs a home where there's no small animals, so no kitty cats. If you have iguanas in your backyard, you won't if you take Polo home. Oh, so, uh, you, so you said Polo is, f is five. Yes. He really, what I love, everyone I was asking you, I said, is he fully grown? Yes, he and is. Said, yes, he's, he's not too big, no. but he's definitely not small. No, he is, I think he's about 45, 50 pounds. Sadly, he was given up because his owners lost their home. Mm. Um, they had nowhere to live with him. He is a happy dog, just a ball of energy. And he, like I said, he was part of our kids camp program. The kids loved him and he loved the kids. Oh my goodness. So, I mean, that's really good too. So people that are looking for like a family friendly dog and he's pretty well trained. I noticed you were telling him to sit. He loves a little high five and also Paul loves a little treat. Yes. Okay. He yes. loves his little training treats over there. So, you know, Sherry, let's talk about a few things that you guys do have going on. I just want to want to let our viewers know about that because I know you guys are always doing something. I know you were mentioning mm -hmm. an event at the top here. Yeah, so we have Underdog Madness going on. It is today and tomorrow, and it's to feature dogs that have been with us um, unbelievably for more than 100 days. If you choose to adopt one of our underdogs, their adoption fees have been sponsored, um, and they get to go home with a bunch of goodies, including um, some toys, a consultation with our pet behaviorist. You also get a training crate if necessary and a year's supply of heart guard and next guard to keep them healthy. So, you know, it's a great day. It stopped raining. Come to the shelter and um, add a furry friend to your family. So I know. Because, you know, at first I was saying, I was wondering, I was like, are we going to have Sherry to make <laughs> the rain and the flooding? Is she, is she going to make it here? Yes, she's here. Except we're inside our newsroom right now, obviously, to make sure everything stays dry. But so let's talk about how easy I know the adoption process is. I know we always talk to you about this, but there's some people that might be seeing it for the first time. And it can be a little bit intimidating if you really don't know what's all what in terms of adopting a dog. Sure. So to adopt a dog from the Humane Society of Broward County or a cat or a rabbit, it's simple. Just go to the website, humanebroward.com do that pre-adoption application and then stop on by. We open every day at 11 o'clock um, and we encourage you to bring the whole family. Make sure, you know, everybody gets along. Oh, okay. So let's see, Polo, can you sit? He's like, I'm laying oh, down like, comfortable now. I'm, I'm telling him to sit and he's already like, <laughs> do you want a treat? How about a treat? Huh? Ooh, his eyes want? got so big. Here, listen, let's see. Polo, can I see something? Sit. Okay, give me a high five. High five, sit, sit, high five. High five me. Give me a high five. High five. Up top. Down low. <laughs> You're too slow, but you still get a treat. Here you go. He is adorable. So yeah. you know what? Sherry, what I love is we make it so easy for all of our viewers. If you just go to local10.com, mm -hmm. we have all of those details for everybody. Hopefully we can get Polo adopted. Yeah. I would, you know, Sherry, what do I always say? I'm always trying to take a dog home, but I've never successfully taken a dog home. <laughs> One of these days, hopefully, I will get one. I know Andrew's like, come on, Alex, let's go. Yeah. But listen, thank you so much for being here, Sherry. Thank We're going to have all these details on our website, local10.com. All right. What?